On July 17, 1925, news came of the discovery of a 2,000-gallon copper tank buried on the Kentucky property of George Griffin Feldhaus. Now, this was news because the tank was fitted with a system of water pipes, which allowed the filling and emptying of said tank by the use of compressed air. And what would you fill a 2,000-gallon copper tank with? Illegal spirits, of course. Mr. Feldhaus was set to appear before federal authorities on July 17th on a charge of possession of liquor. The pipes, by the way, led from Griffin's shed to that tank, then from the tank to his basement. On August 9, 1925, Griffin was shot and killed at his garage by unknown assailants, although it was believed to be part of a moonshine war between bootleggers in the area. <laughs> 